all right everybody i am going to be making an eu squad and uh, that's endless universe let me say first thing i you want to do is set it on free and i've already got people interested and you want to start inviting people there's where's my other guy at? This, um So what happens when you try to play three tunes and make a video at the same time <laughs> okay so looks like we got more people that are coming in all right and so what happens let's see first you want to teleport down to in this universe And so the teleport to endless universe will bring you down here uh, this is the NPC that you want to talk to every day you want to pick this up because you only pick up one a day and you'll get a tuck sue toxin all right all right there you get one free tuck sue toxin per day for this person um, I've got a whole storage full and then you want to talk to this person up here momentor this is in Morai by the way if you guys didn't couldn't tell all right so that's right next to that the pyramid on that top north thing corner looks like we have some more people coming and then you there's the advanced endless universe but this is endless universe the advanced endless universe is up there I've got another video on that one but let's go ahead and go to endless universe um, so the epsilon mobs each one of these crystals has a different type of mobs in here uh, like alpha will have flying mobs um, I think beta are pretty standard gamma I think are the ones that stun you uh, so you can't move well they don't stun you they um, freeze you I think that's the, real, the correct terminology uh, epsilon they've got mobs in there that put a debuff on you similar to the one that the toad in flow silver palace does and it's a one shot hit so basically the skill goes on you and then you've got like 20 seconds before it kills you Ada and Delta, one of these is physical immune, one of these is uh, magic immune. So that's why I wanted to show you all the different, some of the different ones on here. I can't remember, you'll see when they go. So basically, if you look on the map, you can't, you can't see it on that map right there, but you see all these lines here? It's those things right here. So you can only stay in one spot. Like let's say this line was here, and it was here. You can only stay in this spot, but you're supposed to um, transport a scroll from this mirror to the next mirror um, I'll show you guys sounds confusing but you'll see and you'll get it after I show you all right no one's talking just make sure all my okay so I have lead I'm gonna go ahead and start this So you just click on through. Time again. You want to do the new trial. There we go. Now, uh, you'll see all these now. Everybody else will see that too. So whatever one that crystal you were on, let's say theta, the two center ones, they can go anywhere. But these ones on the out outer edges, you can only stay in your designated area, right? So that was the data one. You want to make sure you pick the, the correct one. People absolutely hate it when you pick the wrong one and pick someone else's. So his is Delta. Yes, I'm doing this on three tunes. It is crazy. All right, so he's gonna dig it. And then the my dust blade was on Epsilon. All right, so you're not gonna be able to see this, but the, the number one here, Alpha, that they'll take their mirror. Let's go. I'll show you when we dig. Okay. So on this one, you see where this line is? You can stay in here, but you cannot pass this line. You will fail the whole thing for everybody if you pass that line right there. And then on the other side, there's gonna be another part of the line that you can't pass either. That's the mirror for you, right? And then these mobs, I'll show you what they do. Okay, so you see that debuff right there? That's earth-based attack that charges up and deals damage later on. Now, oh shoot, I don't have enough chi. Let's get some chi 
to you real quick. There we go. All right, you, you want a triple spark to get rid of it. Or if you're like me, you kill them first before they can get you, right? And also, there's another thing. If you see two, every time you kill one of these, you get one of these Jado, uh, Jada Halo. Oh, shoot. Oh, man. It's like Also do that, I think. Come on. I have the genie without. Okay. I, I did save myself. It didn't kill me. Woo! I'm just sitting here messing around. Anyway, so I'm gonna kill all these. I'll show you something. When you get a bunch of these JLo things. I, I, I'm saying JLo like the uh, the singer slash dancer okay so on this side you do also see that there's another set so you can go into here because you have to deliver the quest here but you cannot go past it here right and these little guys here sometimes they'll stun you sometimes they'll purge you so if you can get yourself an anti-stun when you go through um, but you see these once I get a couple more of these I'll, I'll have a super buff Okay, so the barb's over here. And see, he just got lit up. Alright, so the, the barb was first. So AJ just delivered it. I'm picking it up here. And I have to run this gamut. So I'm going to put on my anti-stun. And run, run, run. My sass song, the do run, 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 the do run, run. Oh, yeah. Alright, so we're going to deliver it. You still can deliver it when you're sealed like that and then kill some of these bad boys that's what happens when you have a bite build so I have a bunch of these here all right and if you connect enough of them I'll show you the, uh, the buff you get the mobs haven't respawned yet I'll go deliver it and then I'll come back and kill them Anti-stun. Holy path. I think that might be the last one, and that's the one my archer's in. So they have some time for the mobs to spawn again. And if they got purged, the person got purged, go ahead and give them a. Uh, I was going to rebuff him, but he, he's already he got my buff. Ta -ta -ta -ta. All right, so here we go. The mobs are responding. I'm going to show you just in time. So you see, see that buff right there? I'll show you that. Um, each crystal or area has a different set of mobs, and they have a different amount of those JLo stones or whatever it is. I don't know exactly. There you go. I have it now. So that spark or that dang it, that buff. Doubles the skill damage to monsters. Oh man. I didn't kill him. Okay, and you can't cross that bridge either, by the way. Okay, so I'll go here to safe zone. I think my archer is about to come. But so, like, uh, Cat has it now. So you can do double damage to the, the bosses later on, which is very helpful. Remember your ABCs, guys. Always be cheating. You heard it here on the Jin Wolf channel. Alright. So, Jassy just delivered it. There you go. I have it now. And these things will stun the heck out of you. So, I'll put my anti stun. And run, run, run. Oh, I don't have another run coming up. Watch this. Oh, look at that. Alright. So the final one's delivered. You'll see this message here where it says, The Mirror of Eternity has been lit by the Theta Gem. Heroes return to the entrance once your Helix orders are complete. So 
Basically, everybody has to come back up here to the entrance. Easiest way to do that is to jump off a cliff. Right? They'll tell you to jump. Everybody jump. There you go. It automatically transports you back. Everybody has to be here before the um, the leader to start the next part. Okay. So I'm gonna buff everybody up, and then you just take the quest. Oh, shoot! No, it's this one. I forgot. And you'll see that boss up here. That's the next target boss. Let's go ahead and get everybody a little speed boost. I love that skill. It boosts everybody in the squad. Saves everybody uh, a run and basically tells everybody to hurry the heck up. <laughs> Alright, so. I don't know why the, we're all fighting them out of here. Oh shoot. And so he's gonna. He's gonna be a jerk and push everybody. There you go. He's gone. Let's go ahead and get people running. All right, so that was the first boss, pretty easy. He does have a lot of hit points though. Oh no, not too much, I guess. So the barb's not gonna be too good for the next part. Um, this next boss I'll show you and I'll explain what we have to do to it. So I'm just going to park him up here. That's our next boss. Alright. have a BM in here so you want to they basically we're gonna nuke this boss right spark and we're gonna have two sparks and then... there we go boom if you don't do that fast enough you have to kill all these other mobs that keep spawning up and it takes like good two or three minutes longer actually more like five minutes longer um, so it's best to have everybody spark and nuke that boss alright and then the next part the archer is actually going to be the number one on here but this is the last boss in here and the first round he comes around you want to damage him, um, it has to be at least 25% I do believe. Um, someone might want to correct me in the comments if it's not. But if you get him past like the 25% he'll run away. Um, and then he won't come back. If you don't damage him enough, he'll come back like two or three more times. And it's a much pain, but see we already got him almost up to 40%. And then he'll come around. He's up there. And here he comes up again. Let's have us some fried chicken. Alright, get him on tack. And get him on tack. And that's uh, basically it. You'll, you'll see how you finish it, though. You do have to stay in squad. And you all have to jump off and go to the beginning. Right? And then... Right here. If you had not done this today yet, you'd have a flag over their head and you can get um, some mats from him. Um, but I've already done it on all three, so... There we go. Tuxu toxins disappeared. You gained 500 event gold. Shard or the blades. So, you get one of these, and then the 500 event goal, which is five goal over here. That's gonna be your event goal. Alright.
Okay, so that's it. That's EU. It's pretty simple. You just remember to stay in your area and don't cross the other line. Um, just deliver your papers and just try to survive the mobs. Um, it's not too hard. I think you have to be a level 100 or at least be able to get in here. Alright, if you have any questions, go ahead and post them in the comment section and we'll have to try to answer as soon as I can. Alright, if not, I will see you back in game.